That is an interesting looking bus. Thank you, Tom. Hmm. Well, it is Earth Week. It's yes. a time to celebrate and learn about our environment. And tonight, Chief Meteorologist Tom Mester is live at Echo with a look at what's going on at the Burlington Waterfront. Tom, are you staying green there? Oh, we're being green and we're going to get even greener as the show moves along and I'll explain more in just a minute. Now, let me show you something because coming up in just a few minutes, we're going to take a look at this thing down here. Not the car that's pulling away, but the bus. This is a solar bus. It is very impressive. You talk about being green. Not only is the paint job green, but it's just green the way it works. A lot of stuff to show you that is very, very cool live from Echo and we'll catch you from here in just a little bit. That is an interesting looking bus. Thank you, Tom. Hmm. Well, it's been a week since. Well, this Earth Week, we have brought you stories about green living, city cleanups, uh, and recycling. And today we're getting an inside look at a bus that runs on solar power. Hmm. Kind of cool. Yeah. Chief Meteorologist Tom Messner live at Echo tonight with more on that. Tom, tell us about the bus. Oh, this is so cool. I can't tell you much about it, but Gary Beckwith can certainly help us out. Come on in, Gary. He is the keeper of the solar bus that you Hi. see behind us here. And why don't you step over here? Because sure. before we talk about the bus, give us a quick lesson on how solar panels work. Because I see you have one set up sure. here. And when the sun is shining and I'm not standing in the way, we got some bubbles going. Well, we got to flip the switch on. OK. So when the thing is going, how does this yeah, work? This is what we call an array direct system. There's no battery or anything. So whenever the sun is shining on the solar panel, we get bubbles. So whenever you see bubbles, you know the sun is shining. You know you can uh, cover up the solar panel and and it stops blowing. And I find it's a really good educational display of solar energy because people can really, you know, interact with it. And that's what we do at the solar bus. The solar bus is a, it's an educational project to try to teach people and show people that solar energy really works. And All right, so you're telling me that this bus can drive down the street and some of the stuff inside it is working because of solar energy, right? Yes, well the motor actually runs on vegetable oil. We collect vegetable oil from the restaurants around town and they're gonna be throwing it away and we get the vegetable oil that they're gonna be throwing it away and we run our motor on it. Really? Yeah. And so then, you go there and say, hey, can I have your oil? Yep. <laughs> wow. And, um, that actually is a form of solar energy, if you think about it, because uh, the vegetable oil, the vegetables, uh, you know, grow from the sun. Then we have the solar panels on the roof of the bus, and those charge up batteries, and you can see the batteries inside there, and the, they supply energy for anything we want to do. Like, we can power a concert. We show movies at night sometimes at the Richmond uh, Volunteers Green. We show movies in the summertime. And uh, we come to uh, festivals, we visit schools. And really? We just try to get out in the public and show everybody that solar energy really works. And that is fantastic. Tim was just showing some of the stuff inside the bus. That is very impressive. The solar panels up here. So you guys are going to be here tomorrow showing the kids that are here for Earth Weeks and Mud Fest right. what this is all about, aren't you? We're really excited to be here tomorrow. We're going to be here from 10 till 2. Okay. And uh, the sun's going to be shining. We're going to have all of our displays, not just the solar bubble blower. We've got a water fountain. We've got fans and all kinds of things that Fantastic. run on solar energy and we got a little uh, presentation we're going to do inside as well so we're really excited about it. All right great well thank you so much for your time this is very right. impressive stuff do All appreciate right. that if you can't Thanks. make it out to Mudfest here at Echo tomorrow if you go to our website WPTZ.com we have a link that'll give you a tour of the bus that is very cool you may want to check that out. Have you heard the weather is going to improve in a huge way Keith Carson is locked and loaded and ready to tell us about that. Keith? Thanks, Tom. I like to bring good news, and we definitely have some as we head into the... That is an interesting-looking bus. Thank you, Tom. Hmm.